Hey y'all, it's your girl Dipped in Chanel. Um, we are dipping through today with a tutorial. It is a tutorial on these beautiful spring twists. Many people have been asking me about these on Instagram, so we are just gonna jump right into it. Stay tuned. I'm a savage, classy, bougie, ratchet, sassy, moody, nasty, okay. All right, so I started off on freshly washed, deep conditioned, and blow dried hair. You just really want to make sure you prepare your hair for protective style so that you can actually protect it. So I'm going to start with the back section. Make sure you have a moisturizer and an oil to seal in that moisture. So I'm using Melanin Hair Care's curling cream and my aloe vera moisture uh sorry my aloe vera oil so i start off with the moisturizer then i seal with the oil and then you want some sort of like gel or edge wax i use shine jam but then i also use edge wax so this is the spring twist hair it comes with four packs for about 29 dollars, and it also comes with those hair clips super cheap you only use two packs for this hairstyle that i am showing you today so it's like super cheap so the hair was really springy that's the name spring twist i'm being mad extra right now um but i used half a strand so what i'm gonna do is i'm just taking one strand and i'm splitting it in half it looks pretty easy here and some of them were like this but as i went on some of them were really snagging so you just gotta you know keep trying as you go so i'm starting off with bigger parts in the back because spring twists can get really full if you do small parts throughout the your entire head it will just be like just a full head of twists and i wasn't trying to have that so you start off braiding using um your hair as one the third strand and then when you get to a point that you're comfortable with in the back i kind of did it to, mm, majority of the way down you would split your hair in half and then start twisting the one thing that i really need you guys to listen to is there is a specific way to twist with spring twists and they don't tell you this in all of the tutorials you need to make sure you are twisting in the right direction i at the beginning struggled a bit but i just kept redoing it as you can see this was the wrong way and what happens when you do it the wrong way is the twist looks really limp. It just looks like how the hair looks when it comes out of the bag or it is very holy. Like there are a whole bunch of holes in your twist. Wrong way. See? See what I'm talking about? See what I'm talking about? See y'all? I was getting tired. <laughs> but I um, as you go on you get used to it it feels a little awkward in that in the direction that you need to twist um, but you get used to it over time and if you don't just twist in the opposite direction when you realize that you're messing up so I went ahead and did most of the back And the hair gets really long as you're twisting, but then it springs up into like a cute little lob. And I ended up cutting that a little bit shorter because I wanted like a more distinct bob. So here's the back. As you can see, the twists look great. Braiding at the root helps secure the hair because the hair is really slippery. So you want to make sure that you have that security at the top. I always wanted to do that, just get a bag of hair thrown at me. Yeah, so that's why I included this clip. All right, so let's get into the more detailed tutorial. So I did smaller parts in the front, as you can see, using my moisturizer, sealing with the oil afterward, and then using my edge wax you really need some sort of gel or edge wax to keep your hair from popping out of the spring twist so you start braiding at the root it looks tight but it's honestly not that tight So there's no specific amount that you need to braid, just braid to a part that you're comfortable with. And then when you decide to stop braiding, 
you are going to split your hair in half as I'm doing here. I took a little more edge wax as I went back in to twist. Just so that my hair won't pop out out of the twist and people won't be able to tell. Yikes, yes it's tight but it doesn't bite. Rip it right. I'm a savage, classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty, okay. Acting stupid, what's happening? What's happening? He said the way that thing move is a movie Told that boy gotta keep it low, leave the room key I done bled down the block, bitch, I'm tuned she I'm moody and I'm moody yeah. Day to night to morning, keep with me in the moment I let you hide and on it, why don't you say so? Didn't even notice, no punches left to roll it If you can see it from the front, wait till you see it from the back Wait till you see it from the back it as i said the hair gets really long as you're twisting Ooh, look at my double chin it's just really hard when i was twisting and trying to watch tv at the same time but you want to get all the way to the end and that's how it looks this is the almost final product so now I decided to take an apple cider vinegar rinse from Cream of Nature just in case I was allergic to the hair. I know I should have done this first, but I didn't think about it till afterward and I just didn't want to take any chances with this um, irritating my scalp. So I just sprayed a little bit through the hair and kind of rubbed it through. Um, it did help. It could have been just in my head, but it did help. I took some mousse and this is the main choice mousse and you just want to put it in your hair to kind of hold um your natural hair from flying away within the twists so i'm just gonna put it all through And then I didn't show this on camera, but you can just cut it to your desired length or leave it like this. It's up to you. I decided to cut it and this is the length that it came out to. I absolutely loved it at this length. It's really lightweight, super bouncy. Um, it looks like natural hair to a certain extent. And I was just feeling myself as you can see here. So y'all gonna get these, y'all gonna get these angles and some extra photos, okay? Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. I'm here, as you can see, I'm posting more regularly. Thanks for all of the support. Bye. You it for life, yikes. You a clown, you do it for likes, yikes. Yes, it's tight, but it doesn't bite. Rip it right.